Okay. <laughs> I don't know how funny I could be about zips. <laughs> <laughs> We were going to talk about panel shows, and you've you've been on a lot of these. Yes, I really like them. Right, okay. But you said you you don't enjoy them. I don't really enjoy them because I'm not a comedian. No. And you're expected to be funny. Often non-comedians are much funnier than comedians on panel right. shows because they're not filtering. And because because probably, they talk naturally. And they're not trying to crowbar in 30 seconds of their latest stuff. talk. Yeah. Yeah. Because that happens a lot. And sometimes comedians, because they're trying to do that, because they panic and go, I'm here literally in your job title you're supposed to be funny yeah. so when you're not whereas it's so such a relief to be there not as a comedian because then when you're funny like what a wonderful thing that happened organically yeah does it always yeah. do, do you always get on with the comedians on there or do, i'm not going to ask you to yes. name names oh, but the majority like... of comedians <laughs> basically we're so to a penny you know we're yeah. so replaceable there are very few not nice people yeah very few right but so they're, most, the ones, they're the ones that are massively successful. Though. <laughs> no, 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 the opposite. Most because you wouldn't get reemployed if right, you behave okay. badly. Yeah, I once did one, and uh, someone on the panel show in the meeting beforehand, they they told us a few of the questions that might come yes, up. Yes, yeah. And I gave an answer, and they stole it. Your joke. They absolutely stole it. Yeah. Word for word, yeah. and then looked over and winked. Oh. I was livid. But that was one of the greatest lessons anyone's taught me, which is keep your powder dry. There are some shows where the comics. Are on the same show, won't do prep together. Right, because they're because worried. someone was because someone was repeatedly doing that. Like you know, Re- really. Yeah. So you go into the meeting like just they just check. You know, is everyone's got stuff on Boris Johnson? Everyone's got stuff on this, and then but you've heard the angle that someone's got. And then, oh, oh, that go. that is a good. I mean, but that's horrible. That's very rare, though. But do you prefer yeah. running your own panel show or being on them? Because it's a different job. Yeah, it's very different. You don't have to. Be, I mean, you're just reading an auto cue. It's right. very. There's less sort of. I like playing the games actually. Yeah. I do like playing okay. the games. And, and do you like doing sewing bee? Do I like? Because I sewing love bee? watching watching. I love watching it, and I always yeah. think to myself, that's a good job because there's a lot of hanging around. There's a lot of, I, well, I did a Christmas one and I watched Joe and I thought there's loads of breaks. Yeah. <laughs> and that's when they, when, they, when they were sort of interviewing for the job. I thought, oh yeah, I'd love that. I'll get loads I, done in the, in the bits yes, in between. And I'd seen that he had a little bed in his dressing room and I thought, uh, yeah, I want a bit of that, of that bed. Enough. But no, they're constantly have you working. Yeah, you so, oh, lots do of rehearsing. 15 minutes to go. Or you're going around a corner to film a different bit on a mannequin explaining right. poppers or something. And they say, Hems. oh, can you think of something hilarious for 30 minutes to go? And oh, you have to think of it on the spot. It's worse than that. You have to write it in advance, really? send it to producers who write back and go, this isn't funny. And it's like, <laughs> okay, I don't know how funny I could be about zips. 